Hey everyone, this is Tan with an amazing new update that we just released, which is about the system pages. You can now fully customize more than 10 different system pages and we've introduced a brand new widget called the membership registration. So it's an amazing lead generation type of a widget and I'll show you in a moment. So let's start with the system pages. So these are all the system 404, store, access, all these things pages that you can now modify with the builder. And you can find them when you go to the pages click on system pages is indicated with uh, this star at the, uh, on the folder so there you see all the different system pages that are currently available soon we'll be adding a few more as well so let's start one by one so which are these system pages this is of course the 404 the not page not found so you can now fully customize the background the text uh, you can add whatever information that you want and you can redirect people wherever you want you can add links you can add whatever you wish to fully customize this experience and you can do it for every page here so this is the not enough permissions this is a great way as well to now modify if someone doesn't have access to this page uh, as a membership so you can add some kind of a call to action for example by default it should not have a call to action so you can add your own call to action going for example to a pricing page where they can actually purchase access to this content that was not available for them or directly add a checkout as well. You can also add a checkout where people can actually submit a payment uh, for uh, getting access to this uh, to this page. Very soon we'll be adding an option for you to do different access denied pages for the different membership groups to assign them so that you can actually have a unique access denied page uh, maybe with, like I said, with a checkout uh, where they can submit a payment right away. Anyways, you can fully modify it. Uh, you can also page protect it with a password so you can modify this page members details this is the page where it's the membership for a, a website in the funnel so you can add different information uh, this one particular you cannot edit the widget it's a system widget uh, all the information is populated but soon we'll be adding uh, different options different design versions of this section so that you can modify uh, with this uh, with these options design options Currently, you can just modify everything around it. Then is the login and registration. And here is the new widget, the login registration. This is just the system pages that you had before. Uh, maybe you've used it, maybe you've not. But this is where people can now log in and register for their memberships by default. And you can fully customize everything. And this is the new widget. And you can enable logins, registrations. The default view can be login or registration and you can show a custom page after they register or login so that they can go to a specific page where do you want them to uh, it doesn't have to be just from the membership group as before now we can select it and the other great thing is that you can actually assign where do you want them to go as a group so when somebody registers on this form they'll be assigned to uh, a group it can be the default it can be some of the, the one that you select so you can fully do it like this and with this widget, you can actually create multiple different pages with this form, which are assigning people to different memberships. This is really great, for example, if you have um, a way for you to share, for example, a video or content after they give their information. As before, where they can actually share with everybody else once they sign up you know, with a form, uh, everybody else could get all these things for free without having to you know give any information but now only members you can do it with this form only members can have access everybody else would have to uh, you know again to fill this form so they don't have access please go and uh, fill in the form to get access to the content so this is really really easy way people filling the form getting access to whatever content you can also tag them now from here when somebody registers they'll be assigned to a special uh, tag and the great thing that you can add any type of field that you want from the CRM. So you can just create a property there and you can link it here. You can add a phone, you can add a, um, a city, for example, any type of information that you want to collect. You can now collect it from the uh, membership and registration. So you can play around and modify everything. This is just one design, of course, and you can modify the way you want and have a separate page for login for registration. That's up to you. Um, and if you want you can click on save changes then it is the store products now these are the the all the different store system pages and you can now modify them inside the builder 
instead of having to just select the layout you can now modify the page of course this is a widget now uh, very soon we'll have a lot more functionalities and uh, options to change design but currently these are the ones that you previously had in the store section so now you can select it from here you can modify different uh, places you can change related products you can add different sections that you might desire and this will be the template and this information that you see here is obviously just a placeholder and whatever product you create that will populate uh, on this it will be replaced with uh, on this information so this is just a template of this page now of course you have for the store catalog as well so here you can modify again settings of this widget however you want to look like with different you know settings that you have advanced filters on top filters you can modify play around and create the page that you always wanted very soon again more customizations but this is very cool now that you can modify it then you have the cart. Of course, you can modify this page as well. You can add different things on top of bottom if you desire. If not, you can just leave it as it is. Then you have the store checkout. Now, at the moment, it is empty cart, so you cannot really see information, but you can do th things like styling and branding. You can customize how your checkout would look like, uh, different settings as well. Uh, if you want to preview with the actual product, you can just preview the site. Uh, you can go to your store and you can just add a product let's just add this product and now if we refresh refresh this page we already have a product in our uh, cart so you will now see the process you will see the checkout and you can easily modify to be one step to show summary or not that's all options that you can do and um, you can modify you know the looks and every of everything the way you want so it's fully customizable and you can add whatever information you want as well at the bottom and on top uh, order complete obviously it's about completing an order so you can modify this um, make sure that you don't um, change this information uh, so it instructions are there uh, then you have the order processing if uh, if an order is being processed like PayPal order cancelled if somebody cancels an error if there is an error with the processing of the payment and finally is the download and this is of course you can fully modify as well and uh, this is a special button as well the special widget that you cannot modify because this will be depending on what kind of a digital product a person purchases this will be the 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 page that they will be linked to with the unique product that you will be able to download from this button so you can of course modify how it looks but the url uh, it's its system url you cannot modify it so this is how simple it is to modify all these system pages yourself uh, like I said, we're probably adding a few more as well, but it is so simple to modify them now. More ch changes and uh, settings are coming soon. And the amazing uh, membership login and registration. This allows you to make any type of amazing uh, um, ways to generate leads. And instead of form, uh, in certain cases, if you want to give access to specific uh, content, you can just make it with the membership login registration form, uh, which makes them automatically as a member so make sure that you create your membership groups here to which you want to assign them to and of course don't forget that when you do memberships you have to assign a page to be members only so if we do the contact go to the settings and make sure that it is members only and select your membership group so this way when you go to a thank you page you can make it a members only so only people can see who are members can see the content that you want them to see and everybody else has to submit their information so it's really easy and, and simple to do that um, what else is in this update and the store in the styling and branding you now have this view where you can visually see that what kind of a page you'll be editing so if you're going to edit the card you just click here go into the builder you can start modifying the card it's a lot simpler than before it's more visual and uh, yeah a lot more customization of course uh, so this is it. There is a brand new widget as well for the white labels for registrations and connecting and but I'll have a different video for that so you can check out the video later today or tomorrow uh, about talking about more the white label and the new skin for the white label uh, which has uh, new functionalities and new design of the whole white label itself the management panel so you can check out that uh, cool video uh, that will be uploaded later into the channel so these are the system pages some uh, a new a new widget a few new other widgets uh, widgets as well that have been introduced 
and hopefully this will help you do a lot more uh, with your websites with your funnels and of course a lot easier for lead generation and membership management all right this is from miss dan and if you have any questions don't hesitate and let us know